Haskins over at first. You, then you have Bryce Harper just getting back on the team that can do it if they let those uh, two get smoking hot. I couldn't believe watching the Giants with their minus 250 to make the play championships because you still need to score runs. <laughs> Tampa last year. <laughs> they still are top 10 in pitching year, uh, team year. Yeah, I, I got to go with what my guy Cliff said. The Phillies are a team to me, seven of them. 73% chance to your point, Ariel. The Phillies in second out of those five teams. 68% Marlins, 62 d backs 53 Reds, shockingly, only 20% chance, according to Fangraphs, to make the postseason for all those above of the above reasons. And I've had some good conversations with Dave Dombrowski saying we're probably going to be aggressive. We just oh, have to get definitely. in to yeah. the wild card. And then the, the Reds the could The only be issue I have with the Giants Maybe they pick quick. up Lucas the, Giolito. I, I like the Giants a lot. There's something that wins championship, championships defense, too. Yeah. Pitching and defense. Yeah. Defense hasn't been there the way we've seen the Giants defense be there in the past. Yeah, that could be a, a tough hill to climb for the San Francisco Giants. I'm Lauren Gardner, and off-base starts right now. On the road and have a good time out there. Eat good food. It's great. We'll be sitting here eating food in Secaucus, New Jersey. Like I, I have my my little shake behind the chair here, and then I drink during our commercial. No, we're talking about these, these, these extravagant. Yeah, when, what I have after this show. You have that tonight. She act like she oh, don't, yeah. she act like she the only one working oh, like that. <laughs> <laughs> On the road, Ariel Epstein, how was your weekend? Weekend was good, relaxing, didn't play. Football season is when Sundays are supposed to be ruined. Until yesterday when you're a Yankee. Early in the morning. It's a that. workout I place here. You on your, uh, that's man. the problem. I'm, I, was, I was an athlete, but these people were training for something totally. They have no glutes right now. I can't even take a seat. Like, this hurts sitting down right now. I don't know if I want to call you softer. I'm just saying, like, maybe they're okay, just, like, then you go, No, because it wasn't the beginner or yeah. – I probably would have cried within yeah. like three minutes of the yeah. class. All change. right, let's check out what's been trying to create more offense. This team's going to be dangerous. Yeah, I think they're going to find a way to add. Yeah, yes, we've been sleeping. I think mostly because possibly the best closer right now in the game. Every time he gets an opportunity, he locks it up. So that's what experience comes into play this second half. Yeah, Cliff, they experienced those flashes, but we were talking about five of six and three of those five wins. They shut out the red, so it's not just the pitching, it's their offense. Yeah, you know, you know, those Brewers better continue to be buyers at this. What you can bring in, like when we get to the trade deadlines all the time, it's like in order to fill a hole that. for you. Yeah, a short yeah. period of time, and there's no guarantee you're going to make it down the stretch. Because even that. winning your own division, we saw what happened with St. Louis last year. They were upset by the wild card. Right. Philadelphia Phillies uh, for the Red So I talked about maybe the last one out there and doing his thing, and I think that's what's been fun watching him. I love the confidence, the stealing. Start week, right? Like, a lot of us were already in Seattle. Yeah. We were kind of paying attention to the festivities out there. And then Ellie De La Cruz is still doing Ellie De La Cruz things. Yeah, I just like the fact that the Reds are calling up these, right, with the, you know, the whole pitch clock and cast can't throw over the first base. Mm -hmm. Run. We have guys with speed. Guess what? We can win games with speed. We're not doing little things to get to second and third on the, on the ground ball that scores them. You're not winning consistently. So, you know, if Stan and Judge is out and, and Stan is not, you know, struggling to you and they're going to put pressure on the defense. It, we, we've seen and the teams that make the mistakes, right? You, you mentioned a Cardinals team that had been so only being three games back. They've only played, what, six games that's already been built for it. There'll be a team that looks at the trade deadlines have stepped up. McCormick this past weekend against the Angels just went off. Yeah. And I think when you start to expect that from no, he had a good weekend with the big home run yesterday. So, and then Kyle Tucker, like, sometimes we forget Out about how good world, Kyle Tucker man. is. It's just unreal back-to-back 30 homer seasons. But they, ha they have it built. They can do it. Quick, I know you're trying to jump in, Cliff. Jose Orquiti made a rehab start with the Space Cowboys, one of my favorite names in minor league <laughs> baseball. He's looking Gotta for just have to get hot in September. Nobody now. mentioned Jeremy Pena, by the way. We also forgot about the World oh, yeah. Series MVP. Altuve could begin his rehab assignment um, during this time. Signs of him improving in the, the latter part of the first half. But if they expect to be where they... He did fall ill on Friday, so he is making his way back to everything. So what I'm trying to say is once those two are back in place, along with Urquidy, this team, in my opinion, can be unstoppable. I was in Arlington with those Rangers, and I think they have everything they need in order to make it to the postseason. I just see them getting in as a wild card. Should we stay in the AL West? Yeah. yeah. They're about to host the Yankees, and then they have another six at home. Cliff, be the last time we see. Thanks. You let them walk. 
I'm let Otani staying. At the arrow, like you, you, you can't let your organization will be the. You don't you'll think be that, in last place. You, they have to understand that you're going to get nothing. Then to Ariel's <laughs> point, what are you willing to leverage for someone who could potentially just perform at the plate or potentially change the whole outlook? Leverage. I, I'm willing to leverage top talent. What it, yeah, whatever it takes. You're, you would you you're willing to give up your number one overall prospect for in Texas? If I'm a team like Seattle who has a chance, like. Like, ball, the Giants? Like, like, Giants look really Giants good. Giants is the only one that stands out to me. Right? Like, I mean, Texas do you believe in the really cross, good. You, do you believe in the anti-crosstown rivalry where they would never give him to L.A.? No, the Angels have to be at a point to where I feel like they're overpaying for Otani. I have to go. It's worth, yes, uh, John Heyman did report that he will not be going to the Dodgers. Yeah, no, the Dodgers. That's why I'm saying you're already eliminating the Dodgers from the conversation, which now The Dodgers you, don't need to be in the conversation because they can go get him. What about San Diego? They've done some crazy San Diego things in the bought past. everything. They done, if you can't win that, you ain't winning. Well, why not? Right. It's well, that's what I like, say about the Yankees. Yeah. There's way more problems than just one player. Well, then he, I 100% agree with Did you. The funny you thing, thing is, Otani trips? would si solve some of the Yankees issues. Just out there. It's giving up, it feels, if the you're a fan. The fan base would be more that. upset. They have okay. a 7% Look, chance of making the postseason, according to the fan graphs. Do, today. When you talk about their pitching, everything they. Time, I think, almost in the history of the club. You're 46 they went and 48. for it this season. And you're 46 and 48. Yeah. Trade them. The fan base will understand, to me. They understand that they're, the, the percentages of losing right now, they already understand. Welcome back to Off Base. Well, it was only a three-day week in the majors coming off the All-Star break, but we're still ready to hand out some hardware to the American and National League Players of the Week presented by Chevrolet. I want to see that from the Padres right now. It's It's got to be now. And that was it. Sense of urgency, man. You hit around the head. That's what they, they don't need play going with. into the unofficial second half of the season, right? Well, I mean.